Hello everyone, this is Sonic Fiend, and we are back with some more Fate Grand Order. And today we're going to, what feels like, reach the conclusion of the singularity. We're facing the Greater Grail. Now what are we looking at here? So we got a little bit of mix of uh, all of the class types here, so... Hmm, what am I feeling like? What are my allies' uh, casters looking like? I actually added quite a few more people since uh, the last part. Some I believe are... A lot of you, I believe, are viewers of this very LP, so... Hopefully I'll get to pick the ones you guys sent. Who is one I've definitely never seen before? Let's try... Let's try Ferdy's Merlin. The Garden of Avalon. Sounds epic. Foreboding, even. Alright, so... We're gonna need a Lancer for those pesky archers. It's been a while. Let's bring Deer Mood back in the mix. Do I have a Lancer type? Cost is a question. Def Success, C Star. Hmm. Team Boar. That's for Riders. Casters. No, it doesn't seem like we do. Alright, so. <clears throat> get the temple. I know I just got something super great last part. Okay, that's for all the. That's for all of the cards. So actually, yeah, you can use this one if it doesn't cost too much. Yes, it does. Never mind. You can keep that. And I want to keep this on for more experience. Like, that's the way I play games. If there's ever... If there's ever, like, an experience-boosting thing, I will have that thing equipped, like, 90% of the time. Either way, I think this should be good. Chances are I'm gonna get carried again. <laughs> Section 10, Facing the Greater Grail. I'll tap a servant's portrait in battle while you check the effects of the equipped craft essence. Isn't that nifty? Matter of fact, I can probably check yours. See, kaleidoscope, begin battle if your NP charge it. E God damn. Makes me wonder though, for all of these essences that boost NP like right away, are there like enemy abilities that decrease the amount you start with? And you have to balance it out somehow? I can see like a boss doing that. Okay, so. Okay, is it me or was that... Did that sound desynced? Or am I imagining things? I know I've heard tell that some servants, like, animations are kind of wonky and they don't exactly match up. I'm not sure how true that is. I guess we'll see when we get there. Actually, hold on. There, that's the order we want. Let Mash get in as much NP as possible. And look at that, she's already maxed. Here we go, it's your time to shine. Just 
We're saving all the NPs for the last battle, as we are wont to do. Also, by the way, if you hear any strange, like, noises coming from the outside, I'm actually recording this, like, in the morning as opposed to the evening time, just because last night I didn't get a chance to. I was too caught up with other things. I kind of, like, conked out early. Oh my god, that extra attack. Oh, he's still not done? Jesus. Okay, nothing special here, but, uh, let's nuke him anyway. Though I think this is a support type thing. Yeah, okay. Eh, that's fine. Also, I think I forgot to put battle speed back up. Whoops. I'll get that for the next fight. Oh my. Well, that's a pretty flower field. Ah, uh, he tanks those. He's good. Let's see now. Let's let everyone do their thing for a little bit. And then just kill him outright. <laughs> Thank you, Merlin. You're looking a lot more, uh, shoujo, for lack of a better term, compared to, say, your Disney incarnation. Just casually training people in the ways of the Keyblade and all that jazz. And sending spiky-haired boys to the land of Winnie the Pooh. Let's see. Actually, let me take this chance to quickly up another servant. Who have I used? I got you a couple parts ago, and you seem cool. So let's put you out in the front. Just gonna throw together any lancer type crystals we have. Whoops, that was a miss. Tap there. Increase the server to maximum HP. Okay, gotcha. Eh, I think that'll do. 11's a decent level number. These are the sort of things I should be doing off screen, but I forget. Because work. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna keep Leonidas on for the rest of the part. Okay, still the same. Well, actually, now there's now we need to put in the rider. Let's see. So for this one, we are going to use... Hmm. Let's use Zomel Gustav's Francis Drake. Sounds like a cool car to use. And 
then... I think I have enough... No, that's 12. No! No, we're still good. Okay. Yeah, so keep before awakening equipped. Oh, and I did find out between parts from a friend that the, um... The support units actually do come in if... Like, one of my main trio falls in battle, which so far just has not happened. Even with the nail biter of a uh, part that was last part. Alright, so let's see. Let's see if we want to do this. I wonder if this Francis Drake has any relation to uh, Nathan Drake. Wouldn't that be funny? <laughs> he sounds pissed, my god. What's this? Rear Guard's Pride. Apply target focus. One turn. Oh, okay, so. I probably don't want that right now. I'll wait for the archer enemies to come in. They just so happen to put the sabers out first. <laughs> I didn't kill? Shot. Also, are these just... Are these moves just getting better now? Is that why they're... Let turn the battle speed up. Is that why they're suddenly... Uh, attacking more than once per round? So I don't remember that. Just go shooty shooty bang bang. All the live long day. Let's see now. Now these are all casters, so. Leonidas fares a better shot. Let's go. Let's do a mix. Voyager of the Storm. MP strength and attack. That's super busted. Jesus. Increase your own MP gain. Pioneer of the Stars. MP gauge level 10. And apply ignore invincible. God damn. How do you touch this woman? Oh, just stab him, why don't you? Here we are. Okay, so on the off chance that we don't outright kill them. Wait, let me apply this first. Oh, that's regular gain. There we go. And for the heck of it, let's just apply snowflakes. Alright, show me what you've got. Golden Wild Hunt. Do heavy damage to all enemies, level 2, plus gain a large amount of critical stars. So she's just meant to crit a lot, I've been... At least that's what her skill set seems to be leaning towards. That or... The Master has built her this way. Which is very cool. Oh, this is speed stuff, isn't it? Oh, let's see. Oh my lord, what is this ruby heart nonsense? Just call on the cavalry, why don't you? Well, no. Actually, yes, because she's a rider. It makes sense.
All right. Now for the last part. Here comes the boss. Okay, so now we got a bit of a mix here. Assassins, casters, and lancers. All right. Or saber driver. Let's get in. Who are we gonna use? Let's use Zaku's Arjuna. Right, and then I gotta be careful who I pick now, don't I? Cause I still kinda want that essence on them. <clears throat> Let me check the trailer again. It is... Caster Assassin. Okay, so we probably want a caster of our own. Yeah, wait. Yeah, that's right. Um... Have I used you yet? I might not have. Oh, you're... Mm. I'm like one over. That's so disappointing. Necromancy. Okay, it's not gonna work on her. What's this do again? Critical star drop rate. Cause I don't think I have a caster variant. Um. Oh wait, wait, wait. Okay, special attack cast for yourself. And that's all there is to it, right? Yeah, sure. And throw in another low-cost hero for the heck of it. Let more people watch the insanity about to unfold. Yeah, we haven't seen you in a bit. Engage. Time for the Greater Grail. This will be our last break. Is there anything you left undone? Oh, that definitely sounds like quote unquote final boss territory. I'm ready. I probably am not, but let's do it anyway. That's good to hear. I dislike masters who can't make up their minds when push comes to self. You're still a rookie, but you've got the most important thing a pioneer can have the divine luck to grasp fate and the ability to make decisions. Don't forget how to be reckless. People like that are the ones who will get be blessed by the stars. If you say so. I don't know what you're talking about. Whether we free or to hit or go back, we need to rest first. Doctor, are you checking vitals? Oh, I'm paler than usual? Uh, yeah, this doesn't look very good. It's because of the unexpected servant contract. Oh, I knew it. This wears down on me too, doesn't it? You never used your magic circuits, and now they're running at full capacity. It's probably putting stress in your brain. Mash set up camp. It's time to make warm tea with plenty of honey. <laughs> Excuse me, I was taking a sip of my own tea as that line uh, scrolled past. He knows. Got it, Doctor. I think tea time is a good idea. Oh, feeding yourselves before the final battle? The man will go hunting for some wild boars. I'm sure there aren't any around here. Besides, forget about me. If you must get something, make it fruit. What difference does it make? It's still nutrition. I like both. Wait, the director can... Wait. I can't believe you had dry fruits with you, director. Oh, okay. I thought... I missed that line. I thought she said the director cooked them. Like, she has a cooking bone in her body? She looks like she's been... Fabulous spoon in her mouth since the day when she's born. I just happen to have them. Citrus is effective against headaches, but that aside. Would you like seconds, Director? No, I'm full, but from now on, remember that I like coffee more than tea. Oh. See, you just lost points with me. <laughs> Anyone who knows me knows that tea is practically in my blood. 
No, that's not it. It's not what I want to- Oh, forget it. The work you've done so far has been passable. As the director of Chaldea, I have to give you credit. What's that look for? I'm sure it's a fluke, but right now you're all we've got. What I'm saying is keep it up and you might hear praise from me yet. I know that even a third rater could do first rate work. <sighs> yeah, you're definitely one of those types, aren't you? <clears throat> well, well, admitting that he did a solid job. Have you eaten something sweet? Ramani, if you got time to be flapping your gums, use it to send Fiend a supply or two instead. I would feel bad if someone failed because they were ill-equipped, especially when they've been doing their best. What's this? Feel bad? How kind of you. Director, does, it, does that mean you're finally opening up your heart? It- Oh my god, she actually did go baka. I was kidding before. I meant pitiful, pathetic. You couldn't even tell that? Well, I never grow tired of watching young men and women interact. Although when it comes to young women, Director, you're not really... Okay, that comment sounds sus. How old are you? Is that right? Certainly the director is older, but I feel like we have similar t tastes. I feel affection for her. What are you going on about? I told you before that you're all just tools to me. He's like, mm. There, see? <laughs> Even the shadowy... <laughs> I was about to make that joke, but then the game did it for me. <laughs> Wait for it. There it is. It's gonna eat me! Oh my god, that was great. <laughs> this game's sense of humor appeals to me. Alright. <clears throat> Damn, I like this guy's uh, portrait. What do you have? Hero of the Endowed. Increase MP gauge. Mm hmm. Mana Burst Flame and Clairvoyance. Was that a JoJo's pose he just did? It looked- well, when I pick him next, I'll have to take a better look for myself. But that's exactly what that looked like, I swear to god. Even though we're effective, you're not doing that much damage? Hmm. Maybe I should have put in Geronimo instead. We shall see. I should have. Uh, I should have checked his brain chain. Oh well. Well, at least enemies will fall faster this way. Pada. Deal heavy damage and medium chance to inflict death and chance to further inflict death to divine targets and decrease defense to all enemies. God damn. This man's going in. I get nuked. Battle 3. This can't be it, right? There's like a- there's a boss coming after this, I feel it. Alright. In any case, let's just, uh, kill them all in one shot. Apparently did another... Achievement? <laughs> By God. They all disintegrated. Well, that was a job well done, wouldn't you say?
Oh, that that must be it. But then why would it give me a prompt to go back? Hmm. Well, I guess we'll be saving the finale of this singularity for next part. And that had all the story beats too. I thought that was going to be it. But shows what I know. Okay, so we do what we always do. It's friend summon time. I don't know why I said it like that. Survey says. So let's skip the rest of this. Okay, here comes something. Something. It's. We have the Phantom of the Opera. We're going to Broadway, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see. Innocent Monster. Ooh. Gain sea stars each turn. Alright. Christine, Christine. Deal heavy, de heavy defense ignoring damage to all enemies and decrease debuff resist. Very nice. Specializing in quick cards. Illustrated by Shimodon and voiced by Ryotaro Okayu. Most likely the model for the figure, the phantom that appeared in the novel The Phantom of the Opera that took place in the 19th century. Living in the vast labyrinth of aqueducts beneath the aqua uh, Wow, aqua house? Yes. Beneath the house of water. I'm going to roll with that now. He was, he was attracted to a young actress and helped her become a diva, but he committed a series of murders so his love could never come to fruition. Don't you hate when that happens? Don't you just hate when you have, like, a genuine affection boner for someone, but then the mur murder boner takes over? It's tragedy, I tell you. Tragic. Whoever sees my face will learn the meaning of fear, including you. Okay, and then let's do another friend, or not friend, a ticket summon. Let's uh, let's use it on. Which one do I want? Yeah, let's let's do it on the uh, Shinjuku. So I'm always a sucker for good-looking alts, and these are some cool, evil-looking alts here. What are we getting, huh? What are we getting? Four star, primeval curse. Oh my. What, does this give... Does this give whoever this is equipped to the power to become a gigolo? Increase your debuff resist by 25%. Alright. Interesting card to illustrate that. Illustrated by Ginka. A simple spell which benefits you by harming another, hence primeval. Well, okay then. Short sweet to the point. I don't know how often I'm going to use this, just because I haven't really fought anything that specializes in debuffs yet. But I'll lock it anyway, I guess. Alright, that's going to be it for this part. Thank you all for watching. As always, the Twitters and whatnot will be down below. I'm going to be getting back into the streaming business soon enough, so I'll probably make community posts on YouTube letting people know when I'm about to go live for that sort of thing, put like an hour in advance. I was actually going to, I was planning to do one last night, but I didn't get around to it just because I was exhausted, but either way, thank you for watching, I have been Sonic Fiend, and I hope to see you all next part for the finale. The real finale, or so I pray.